I'm here with Carly because I'm about to do something that I'm really scared of. It's the 100 shirts challenge thing that I thought I made up, but apparently I didn't. What? I was just smelling all your candles. Are they bomb? This one's the best one. I'm gonna put on 100 shirts and I was afraid I wouldn't be able to get out of the shirts. So I had Carly here to help me. I feel like there was something else I was gonna tell them, but I don't remember it all. Whatever, still bad at vlogging. I don't even know if I have 100 shirts. So I hope I have 100, I know I do actually, but it's gonna be really hard to get them on, I think. Ugh, math. All right, we're gonna see how many shirts this is. I'm gonna give you all a second to guess how many shirts this is and I'll let you know as soon as I count them. Okay, this is 65 shirts, which is terrifying because that means I'm only a little over halfway. This is too many shirts. All right, this is 100 shirts. Now I have to transport these to my office so that we can film. Are you ready? Wait, it's not stressed, it's not stressed out. It's no, stressed out. No, we're stressed out. No, it's up, not down. I promise you. It's, it's up, it's, stressed out. No, it's yes, no. it is. No, it's wish we could turn I'm back to the it. good old days where my mom was saying us to sleep, but now we're stressed no. out. <laughs> <laughs> it is a flare. I play it right now. I am. Here we go. Can you fast forward? I am. Relax. I can't wait to be right. Out. Is it out? No, it's Dude, out. I hear listen. it. Listen, no, listen. You're wrong. You're wrong. No, I'm not. Out. out. I hear it up. No, listen. You're crazy. It. I hear it up. I hear it down. Maybe it's like the music. I think you're hearing the harmony. Probably, but like so. Wait, maybe play it again. So yeah, I was singing the harmony. That's what I was doing. Well, okay, okay, <laughs> Beyonce. <laughs> I One was doing time. runs. I want to hear your part that you're hearing. Think of it going up. You think of it. I don't hear it up at I do. all. I do. What? All right, hold on. Honestly, I think this is the debate of the century because at first I was scared because I'm like, okay, everybody's saying I'm wrong, but then a couple people said that I'm right. So there's people out there that are hearing it my way and I think it's an Illuminati thing. Maybe it's like one of those things where like those optical illusions where there's two different things and if you see the old woman, it means you're depressed and if you see the young woman, it means you're optimistic kind of thing. So you're depressed because you're down. Yes. We're going to listen to it live see to if we see can if we can get better. better. I, it's still I get the, down. It's still like the. It sounds exactly, it sounds the, exactly same. the same. Also, why does it sound Jamaican? It, what? <laughs> he sounds Jamaican. In this. <laughs> when the mama here, oh, let's do a different one. Some his hands. That one was she weird. Went, Ow. Ow. <laughs> okay. We got some acoustic ass ukulele. Ukulele, ass. ukulele pawns. <laughs> wow. Oh, I hate it. Snapchat it. This is an insert. I'm so upset that I didn't save my Snapchat story. I thought I did, but I wanted to show the Snapchat story of all this actually unfolding in real time. So if you're not following me on Snapchat, I'm sorry that you missed it because it was entertaining. Carly actually ended up DMing Josh Dunn of 21 Pilots and asked him how the song went. He said that it goes up. Now, I don't like admitting that I'm wrong. I don't like being wrong. I don't like being proved wrong, but I can admit when I am wrong. And here I am clearly wrong. A member of the band is telling me that I am wrong. However, there is still something that's freaking me out here. And this is a phenomenon that is terrifying me. Now, when I posted on Snapchat, who's right, me or her, a lot of people agreed with me. And I don't know if they were just agreeing with me because they wanted to support me and say I was right no matter what I was saying. But it seemed like a lot of people were like, no, it's down, it's down. And even if they're lying, still to me, I hear it down. And it's freaking me the fuck out that I can be wrong. My own ears are deceiving me. And that's so scary. Like how many things am I wrong about all the time? Like am I looking at blue shit thinking it's yellow and I'll never know? And people will tell me that's blue and I'll be like, no, it's yellow. It's scary to think about. I feel like this is honestly a new the dress situation where a lot of people are seeing blue and black, which it is, but there's still people seeing white and gold which it isn't, but they're still seeing white and gold. That's how I feel about this song. I hear it no matter how many times I listen to it, stressed out, and that's not it. It's stressed out. I don't hear that. It's really freaking me out. This whole situation makes me stressed out. Okay, hold on.
I just realized when I turned on my vlog camera how loudly I was chewing. I was like, <laughs> so you guys saw when Alex built this for me and that was what three days ago It's still in the exact location that he built it. I did not move it because I don't know how to I mean, I could probably figure out how to drill it, but do we really want me using power tools? Probably not because I fuck up a lot of things So he came over because he's a peach to help me put it on the wall. You ready? Yes, we'll see. And the clothes are still on the floor from when I did the 100 layers of clothes video. Um, if you haven't watched that, go watch it. Did you watch it I yet? need to watch it. It's a lot. <laughs> Just spent a disgusting amount of time trying to figure out the mathematics behind like where we draw the lines. That's why there's so many. And none of them make sense. So we're just gonna drill now. Let's go. Love it. Okay. So much faith. Woo! Oh, that <laughs> went in entirely too easily. Shit. Well, well first hole done. Oh, found a stud. Well, at least one side will be secure. <laughs> uh, we somehow, I somehow measured wrong. So I had to take one out. It's not coming out. You know, but I give us like a solid A for effort. It was just, only uh, off by like half an inch. Which is a lot. Okay, but we're not professionals. This is the moment of truth. This is like screwed, unscrewed, redrilled, undrilled, tearing anchors out of the wall. Let's do it. I'm scared. Let's see if this motherfucker fits. I swear I'm not incompetent. It's, it's hard. It's, it's rough. Watch this Never fall. Know what I said. Please don't forget. Okay, yeah. Uh huh. Nailed yeah. it! So now, what, how do we nail it together though? So I have to drew, uh, drew, screw drills, or <laughs> screw screws into the bottom of this through. Oh, stressful. No, we can do it. Here it is. I still have to put the shelf right here, but when I tell you I had a full, are you in this? Probably. <laughs> I had an actual breakdown where I cried. Th did I throw something? You I don't just remember. You threw a screwdriver down. Yeah, and I said, I just want to rip it off the wall. And then I went in my room, laid in my bed, and cried for a while because the screw just wouldn't fucking go in. And I think it's still not a little bit, but like I'm pretending like it is so I don't have a nervous breakdown. It's fine. And I have to get a chair, have to put up the shelves, have to look at the holes that uh, don't belong there. But what are you gonna do? <laughs> the markings all over the wall that I need to deal with everywhere. Like what's this mark even here for? Everything's messy before you clean it up. But why is this here? What were we Those even- were our initial measurements of where we wanted it on the wall. <laughs> I'm actually lightheaded from the events that have happened. You're a warrior. He calls me a warrior princess a lot. <laughs> I have this makeup on for a video that I just filmed, but I'm kind of freaking feeling this look. And honestly, I wish that I was 15, 16, 17 again so that I could pull this off. Cause I think I look dope. I loved dressing like this back in the day and I still would if it was socially acceptable. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I should start putting shadow under my eye more. I always keep it clean on my under eye because I have such almond eyes that I was always really insecure that it made my eyes look droopy, but I think that it actually looks kind of nice. I feel like I need to start shadowing my under eye. I feel like every time I've ever got it done, it was when I had a really bad makeup artist and they didn't really know what they were doing. So I just always thought that I didn't like it when it wasn't that I didn't like it. I just didn't like it when it was done poorly. And I had somebody do it for the Teen Choice Awards and it looked so good. And obviously this doesn't really look that good, but the idea is there that it's, you know, smoked out under the eye. So even though this is an emo look, let me know in the comments if you think this is something that I should do when I actually do my regular makeup, kind of like smoke out the bottom, because I never do. Uh, it's super late. I ate a lot today. I should go to, I didn't even work out. Oh, I should do some squats or something before I go to bed just to say that I did. I don't know if I have enough footage to sign this vlog off yet, but just in case I do, I still don't have a sign off anyway, so.